Hi guys. So in this episode, I'm going to decode the process of like how to get hired with top notch companies. So if you want to get shortlisted your resume and also if you're looking for, you know, any dream job or position with any top notch global giants like Goldman Sachs, Zeppi Morgan, fund administration houses like Apex and Citgo, then this episode is for you. All right. I'll, I'll decode very organic process how you can you know generate more and more offer letters because i have also you know i have, I have been following this process since last couple of years and i have got a fantastic result so same you know process that i want to tell you right now so let's start it see here i'll i'll uh, give you 10 different you know methodologies or techniques or i would say recommendations that you need to follow in your career so let, let's talk about first one, market research, right? So you need to do the market research, understand the market size, understand the market, uh, you know, opportunities, government policies, international, let's say policies, how it will impact. Let's talk about, you know, with example, if I talk about now, let's say renewable sector, right? In renewable sector, government has announced so many schemes and now the renewable sector which is at a booming stage so why don't you try to upgrade or understand this industry or upskill your knowledge so that you can grab you know reputed uh, you know position in reputed organizations why don't you do this all right same if i talk about in terms of fund administration most of the fund administration houses they wanted to start their business in india from an operation perspective, because India, which is, you know, uh, which is, which is a very cheap, you know, market in terms of cost so that they can hire accountants, qualified accountants at a cheap rates and assign their jobs or activities. Are you getting a point? So this is how you can perform market analysis. If you perform market analysis and understand the scope and opportunities, trust me, you can tap market opportunities as well. Do you agree with this? Then let's discuss about next. Next point is select top 10 companies. If you select first your industry, let's say if, if I'm assuming that if you select your fund administration or investment banking, let's say vertical, then from investment banking or fund administration vertical, why don't you select top companies? Top companies, it can be Goldman Sachs, Northern Trust, BNY, right? Or other fund administration house like Apex, Citgo, Line Data, uh, DSO Group, and many more others. So if you target, see, if you narrow down your target and approach, then you can easily find, you know, opportunities. All right. So finding top 10 companies, which is a very important. And apart from this, see, this process is very important, guys. If you select top 10 companies, why don't you perform in detail fundamental analysis of that particular companies means in terms of let's say financial results how that companies are publishing their financial statements in terms of balance sheets pnl why this is so important sir you see if any company is any xyz company is performing solid financial results so it means that company will offer you attractive salary annual appraisals annual bonuses and all other benefits as simple as that. If you select any company where, let's say, if XYZ companies, that reason they are publishing. If I take the example of Baijus, see that Baijus, they couldn't process payment of employees. All right. So financial statement analysis of any organizations which matter a lot. Because, see, you are looking for a career. You are looking for a five to six year journey with that organization. So it means you should check the pocket of that company, which is mandated for you guys. But most of the, the brutal fact is 90% people, they don't check. But you should check this one. It's a mandate. It means it's a mandate. All right. Apart from this, once you select fundamental factors and if you figure it out top 10 companies, why don't you check the recent job postings? So where they post, of course, check their career portal. Every company has their internal you know, job posting portal. You should go and visit that portal and create your own identity and profile and check the recent postings. When they post, let's say, fund accountant job, recon job, just check it. If that job description matches with your profile, even if it is not, then you can amend that. All right. So that would be a third point I'll talk 
you know, quickly. But yes, if you are agreed with this selection of top 10 companies and analysis of, you know, data, fundamental analysis, basically, and all, then I would say immediately start selecting your top 10 companies. If you are not able to select top 10 companies, you can call my team. We'll help you to analysis your profile and we'll give precise data so that you can follow the same. All right. Look, I'll give you now third point, which is a very important one. See, nobody decode this process, but I'm doing this and free of cost for you guys. Third is craft stunning resume. You can leverage out AI, chat, GPT or all other to write your resume. But here is the catch. Make sure that, see, if you select any company, go to their job portal, check their job description, latest job description and try to match your roles and responsibilities, which you have updated on resume with posted job description accuracy it should be at least 50 percent if you follow this in a 90 percent cases in a 90 percent cases my all students you know got a call from recruiters they got a job they even they you know uh, got an interview calls offer letters and now they are working fine so it's a technique make sure that your resume responsibilities which are matching with your Companies, companies posted, you know, job description, the accuracy, please maintain that at least 50%. If you maintain, then definitely you will get a call. And apart from that, here is the again, one more important point that I would like to, you know, provide to you, which is always include demanding skills, right? Fund accounting, recon, you know, business analysis, and all other keywords, powerful words, which is required on your resume. Why it is so, sir? See, try to understand the algos of recruitment platforms. When HR search your candidature or profiles, HR always off update keywords in a, you know their fields and search profiles. If keywords matches with your profiles, then only HR's attention will get on your profile, and HR will shortlist and call to you. Do you agree with this? If yes, then click on button. Point number four, mock interview practice, guys. See, when you select your, means if you, let's say, perform market research and then, you know, uh, select top companies, craft resume, stunning resume, but what about practice? If you don't know how to manage your interview conversation, then no use of it, all right? 90% candidates, <clears throat> they are struggling just because of this. See, they even means it's it's my personal experience. I'm you know sharing with you guys. Uh, every day we receive hundreds of calls for counseling. So look, I have attempted interview, but I didn't get a result. The reason is you didn't perform well in your interview, and nobody share constructive feedback with you. That's the another part. All right. So without practice, if you want to put on weight or put off weight. What is what is required in this process? One is a diet and another one is exercise. So interview, it's like exercise. Without exercise, you can't expect good result. If you if you, you know, perform mock interview practice or schedule a mock interview with my team or you know my experts, we'll help you for that as well. But you can also perform it on your own. And through mock interview practice, you can go through your JD, uh, maybe you know, job description, you can cover other topics you can try to understand a flow of your current jobs and roles and responsibilities you can try to understand financial products accounting reporting and all other you know skills you can also go through the market insights and research and reports also it is a very important one all right if you if you practice this see and apart from this if you have a weak communication or conversation then again, it will affect on your oral performance. Why don't you try to, you know, speak in English as well? So it, was, it means practice out as much as you can. And definitely you can work on your communication. See my communication, guys. Uh, I was also facing same problem. But see now uh, my communication is maybe, you know, I don't want to comment it out, but I'm able to speak and you guys are able to understand. So why don't you practice then? The big problem is practice that most of the people that don't follow the process. And here is the secret. If you can, if you can follow my formula, which is spend daily 15 minutes 
on your practice. Speak with yourself, which is the best and unique technique. You don't need someone to take your mock interview. So you can take your own, you know, you, you can take your interview by own. You can ask questions to yourself and practice it out. Follow this exercise and see the outcome as well. All right. Point number five. So you should always try to leverage out job portals like no career linkedin companies you know internal job posting in a portal why don't you take means why don't you leverage it out leverage it out it means through linkedin you can expand your professional networks through job portals always you can you know design your profile in a way so that you can quickly grab you know job offers because most of the recruiters they are they have joined this you know uh, that no creep platforms, they'll source candidate, good candidates from that portal. So why don't you design your profile and always include that, you know, uh, the, your status, current job, designations, amount, expected salary, your skills, skills and everything. And always, you know, you should update that out as per the, you know, you can perform some research and see the scope and opportunities and do it. Apart from this, always include keywords like fund accounting, merger, acquisition, financial modeling, communication because you don't know that how HR is searching in the back end right so they search profiles through keywords and it is mandated to update keywords and certification and other you know other key details on your profile just follow this do it right away sit check your profile check the health of your profiles otherwise you can connect with us we'll help you for that but it is a mandated one so you should do it it's a very important one all right and key key and always see key information is here so you can update profile update skills certification and all of the details apart from that also update keywords and then you can include keywords trade processing recon fund accounting job uh, that accounting uh, entries and all it is also important and always select industry department and even you can select your key interest areas where that you want to target. See, if you just narrow down your approach, definitely you can generate interview calls. Point number six, network building. Guys, if you don't have a network, professional network, it's difficult to get a job or hunt a job. So why don't you join any professional community, maybe through WhatsApp, Telegram, LinkedIn. Why don't you do this? Always you can look for in a professional community. You can also expand your professional network. You can always try to put something on your profile so that, you know, you can reach to the different different people so that they can invite you for a discussion uh, for, for the discussion. It's a simple process, but you will have to do this. You will have to promote your own brand awareness amongst people. If you follow this technique, trust me, see in last couple of years, I have reached to the more than 20 plus lakhs people. Every day people, they send me an offer. See, look, if you want to work with us, please call and connect. Recently, I got one offer from Dubai. That client want me there to work with them. So this is how you can expand your network. Did you get this? Follow this guy. See, this is an organic process. I'm not asking you to be anything, but this is a, something, you know, Nobody is even sure with price also. So why don't you follow this? Change your approach hereafter. Follow this practice. Your 90% problems will resolve. Okay. Point number seven. Why don't you enroll for highly demanding courses? It can be Power BI, SQL, business analysis, fund accounting, investment banking, merger, acquisition. There are many more. Even ESG in coming time, you may be see big score for ESG reporting and all. So why don't you target? So you should target. See, I personally upskill even AI as well. So how AI is impacting? See, AI prompt engineer can earn up to one crore salary for per annum in coming time. Why don't you target? Nobody asks your qualification now because you're a working professional. And even if you're a student, it's a good opportunity for you. So why don't you do this? It's a good opportunity, guys. Try to grab this opportunity right now. It's a time. It's a high time for you. If you upskill on AI tools, then again, companies will hire you. So you can help them to leverage out that AI in their businesses. All right. Look, look, look. This one is a very important one. Right. If you don't plan this point number eight, which I personally prefer planning for a job switch. If you don't plan your job switch, 
then it will not help at all because entire process that we have discussed from a perspective of like job switch. So you should plan it out your job switch, like how much time that you can spend with one company when you can plan your switch, set a goal, small, small goals and try to achieve those maybe in terms of promotion, salary, high growth, let's say, see in my personal life, I have set my goal like at least I would expect 10 to 15% hike for per annum. If I, if I don't get, definitely I'll look for something better. So same that you can also expect. See, if the company and industry both are growing, you can also look for your personal growth. You should be selfish in this particular case, right? If you are offering some benefits to the business, you can also expect something from them. And if you don't, it is your problem, boss. It is not someone else's problem. So it's a very important one. So plan it out. And if you don't know how to plan it out, come to my team. We'll guide you for that. Point number nine. No one tell you this. Guys, look, job is not guaranteed. Job will not fulfill all your dreams. Job will not feed you everything that you want. It's a you know, brutal fact. Job only help you to change your sabji routine. If you if you are eating sabji, maybe you can take a pizza. But if you want something else like Mercedes or Benz or all other things, you should plan it out something else. You are not a Sundar Pichai so that you can you know, earn well. You are just common or you know investment banker or someone else. If you don't have a plan to you know earn something apart from your normal job then it will not help you at all. Nowadays, see, it's an AI era. You can look for different opportunities. You can, you know, uh, save your time. Then you can utilize that time somewhere so that you can make more money apart from your job. Because see, what if any company announced layoffs? So how will you manage? What if someone fire you? How will you manage your life? You won't be able to survive. And for us, survival is important. And if you don't have a plan for survival, then no one can save this. No one will save you guys. All right. So why don't you look for additional income? If you need some tips, you can text me, text and comment. I will help you for this. All right. And last point, which is the point number 10. Don't take too much tension. All right. See guys. Three idiots aapne dekha hi hoga. What happened in three idiots? Amir Khan, scientist ban gaya. Koi kuch ban gaya, koi kuch ban gaya. Lekin everyone got a job. And if, if you don't get even job, that's fine. Definitely you will do something better in your life. God has a plan for everyone. Someone rightly said, even if you don't want to drive your life's car, someone will drive, God will drive, nature will drive, and you will get everything. Just enjoy the journey. That's all. Zada tension leke nahi karna hai. Kuch nahi hua to kuch na kuch ho jayega. That's fine. Kya karna hai. All right. So follow this process. Proven process. Trust me, you will get a result 100%. And if you have any feedback or suggestion, definitely you can put in comment section. This is for you. Don't forget this. And if you want to upskill or learn something in advanced skills, you can come and talk with me. You can join my any courses that you want. will help you for, for that. All right. So thank you. Thank you very much for watching this. We'll see you in my next episode. We'll cover the next topic. Or if you, if you want me to speak it out on any topic, you can provide that in my comment section. Definitely, I would like to give a try and speak, speak on that or I'll share my opinion on this. All right. So next topic would be I'll give you a hint. Private equity. I'll decode that private equity into you know such a pieces. Why private equity? Why you want that? And so on and so forth. So please click on bell icon button that will give you pop up next time. Don't forget this. And guys, up itne kanju so that you don't subscribe and share because if you don't, ultimately I'll not grow. My motivation is you. You are watching my content. We have completed one lakh one lakhs hours, you know, content consumption, and this credit goes to you. All right. But if you comment, like, and share, so that will help me to grow as well. And trust me, if I grow, I'll uh, offer everything free of cost to all my followers. So that's fine. All right. Thank you. Thank you very much for watching this series. We'll see you in the next episode, boss. Thank you.